Well, hi there. This is Joel Pashkin again, and this is for RVers, and it's uh, 10 Ways to Make Money Traveling, and this is Part 3. And um, the, uh, I'm going to talk about, uh, let's see, there's uh, working in, uh, one of them, one of the things we looked at was working in high-density tourist areas. There are jobs as uh, tour guides, uh, working in restaurants, working in retail establishments um, at these uh, various locations. And um, uh, we decided that we didn't want to do that because even though it could be fun, it looked like work for us and uh, we weren't interested in working, uh, if you, in, in our definition of working anyway. Next thing I want to talk about is uh, hosting. Now, the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers has really beautiful campgrounds and they offer hosting opportunities all over the country. Now, I'm going to post down in, this, uh, in the description box their website uh, to find those. It's, um, it's a website and I'll post it so that you can see. But it, it lists uh, states, uh, counties, and municipalities. Oh, no, no, that, that's for the Corps of Engineers. The other places to look are state campgrounds, uh, county and municipal campgrounds. They also have um, uh, opportunities for hosting. And why we didn't try that was because of the limitations in traveling. I just, it, it, it seemed like every place that we wanted to go at the time we wanted to go there, there wasn't a place to work, so we gave that one up. Then uh, what we did in the winter, when we wintered in Florida, and we came back to Florida in the winter for family obligations, uh, we got a job, and I know other people got jobs in various other places at theme park and uh, local and amusement theme parks. And in the winter, uh, we were uh, really lucky and got a job at Walt Disney World. And uh, it was, um, I, I, what a blast. And it, uh, in our descriptions of other places, when I talk about it in, in providing a job description, what I say with a big chuckle is it, it, was a, it is very, very, very hard to call what we do their work. It's the kind of work that retired people should do. It's not hard. It's really a lot of fun. And um, while, while the pay itself wasn't a lot, um, it was nice to make it. And, uh, and the nice thing about it was really the unlimited free entertainment and discount perks that we got. Um, and that, uh, that was very, very wonderful. And I don't know what they're doing right now the last two years. I do know that they weren't hiring um, any additional people, and uh, who knows, um, that may or may not change. Well, anyway, that's it for this particular video, and um, uh, once again, if you're looking to start a home or RV-based business, uh, so that you can um, really RV in style the way we like to do, or if your present business isn't really making it that well, click on the, dis on the link in the description box right below and get a specific checklist, a free specific checklist of those things that, that every home business absolutely must have in order to succeed. Now, thanks for watching, and I'll see you inside the next video. Bye for now.